Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be doing a briar haul of all the horses I got for Christmas. So yeah, um, this is late, but oh well. <laughs> um, yeah, let's just get started. <laughs> so the first horse I have here is Marcus. Oh, and I also want to apologize for the really bad lighting, but it's like 11 at night and um, yeah, there's just nothing I can do about it, so yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is Marcus, and he's really cute. Um, I was lucky enough to get him on a website where he costs like no more than the retail price. Um, he does have this like one mark right here. You can kind of see. It kind of sucks. But otherwise, he's in good condition, I guess. Well, he's got a little bit of a shiny mark there too, now that I look at it. But, you know, it could be worse, I guess. But yeah, I'm just happy to have him. He's really cute. Um, next I have Lakota, um, quite possibly the most hated horse of 2017. I don't know. Um, <laughs> I honestly kind of like this mold. Like, I don't love it. I tolerate it. <laughs> um, it's not one of my least favorites. Um, I should probably hate it more than I do. Um, but yeah, I've never really hated this mold. I just hate how much it falls over. Um, but I actually really like this guy. Like, he's not amazing, but he's okay. He was the Tractor Supply Special Run. And, yeah, and speaking of Tractor Supply Special Runs, I also got JC. I really like this guy. Like, I really love this mold. And I'll pretty much buy anything Barr puts out on it that has eyeballs. Um... But yeah, I really, I really like this guy um, a lot, and I was really fortunate enough to get these from my local tractor supply, um, and they, my store only got two of each in, and a lady already had a set on reserve, so I was really lucky enough to be able to get them, um, so I'm really happy to have these guys in my collection. And then I also have Griffin over here, the... Um, Collector's Club exclusive guy. He's so cool. I really, really like him, and I like this mold. And I haven't, I haven't got one on this mold in a while, so um, yeah, I really like him. So that's him. And we have Calavera, which is probably my favorite horse of them all. He's crazy looking, but I think that's what makes him really cool. Um, and also, he has like a really unique texture on his markings. Like, if you have the horse, like, you know what I'm talking about. It just, it's very cool. It's nice to feel. Um, and just, he's so neat. Um, like, you could call him ugly, and like, yeah, he is ugly, but like, I like him. He's a like, cute kind of ugly. Um... So, I just really like him a lot. I like his mane. It's very fiery. I just, I don't know. I think he's a really cool guy. And I think it's better than, like, Briar Kids doing, like, the glow-in-the-dark horses for Halloween. Which is, like, fine. But, like, the older Halloween horses had so much originality to them. And I feel like he's kind of getting back on track to that originality. And not just, like, slapping glow paint on him. And, like... A spooky design like this guy is actually unique and I really appreciate that because horses like Phantasma and Twilight Terror I felt like had a lot more thought put into them than like whatever else they've been putting out recently um so yeah I really like this guy and I look forward to what next well I guess it is 2018 what this year's Halloween horse is gonna be I hope it's more along the lines of this where it's unique um, but it probably won't be <laughs> so that is that. And then we have Sugar Maple, who I'm realizing now is like probably really hard to see on my bed. So I'm sorry about that. Um, but he's so cool. Um, I wish I could like, my room's a mess. I don't want to like, I kind of want to lift him up so you can like see him better, but like also not because my room's messy. Um, but yeah, so this guy kind of was sprung up on me. It's like, oh, Briar's making like a fall exclusive. I guess I'll have to buy that. <laughs> so, 
Um, yeah. He's... Uh, he's just so cool. I really, really like him. He's probably my second favorite. Um, of all these guys. I just... I think he's really neat. And if Barb wants to do more fall exclusives, like, I'm down for it. I love the seasonal horses, so just keep it coming, Barb. Keep it coming. Okay. Moving over here. I have a couple of older vintages. Um, I don't know why I said older vintages, because older is literally vintage. So that made no sense. But anyways. Um, <laughs> these two guys I got at an antique store. And um, my mom just saved them for Christmas. But they... Uh, the lady said that she had just put them on sale for it, so I got them both for like, I got this one for 15 and I think I got this one for 20 Um, I can't remember their names off the top of my head, but they are in fantastic condition. Like, for vintages, at a thrift store, for 15 and 20 bucks, this is incredible. And like, usually when you find them at antique stores, they're beat up and they're way overpriced. But these guys are in really great condition and somewhat underpriced. Like seriously, this one, I can't not believe how, like, yeah, there's a little mark, but like, this was a used horse. Like, I, I cannot believe it. Um, just in really good condition. So, these were excellent finds. They had another one there. They had three, I only got two. Um, the other one, I kind of want. But, like, it was more expensive. It was, like, 35 I just, I didn't get it. But I kind of want it. But, um, <laughs> that's another story. Um, one more here, and then I gotta go, go, I have to go upstairs and get the other pair. Um, this is the New Spirit. Um, I have thought long and hard, do I need it? The answer is no. I don't need it, because I have the original Spirit. And I like him a lot better than this one. <laughs> but why did I buy him? Because I still wanted him. And that's just the tea. I wanted this horse. So <laughs> regardless, I got Boomerang. I got Chuka Linda because I really liked those guys. And I was just like, mm, I might as well just complete the set. So this is the Toys R Us edition or is it? I don't know. But the one on Toys R Us, like the website came with this thing. And, um, and this like, bracelet. I like the bracelet. That's why I wanted it. Because it has like the original like spirit logo. So I kind of wanted the bracelet. I thought it was cool. Um, dolls are creepy. This one is no exception. So we'll just put her there. Um, yeah, honestly, I really, I do like this guy. Like I said, like I like the original one better just because it's like the horse I grew up with. Like the spirit that I love. Um, but this one's okay and he's in good condition and everything. Like he's fine. Um, he's just like, you know, like a newer one. And I wish they would have like maybe done a different mold, but I get why they didn't. They just wanted to put out, I get it. I get why they didn't do a new mold. It's just like a little weird to have the same horse, but like a little different. It's kind of weird. Regardless, whatever. I went, I've been talking about this set for too long, too long. <laughs> I'm going to go get the new pair, the new pair. What is that? I'm going to go get, uh, the next pair that I got my other favorites and wrap this video up so as i went to go get the other pair of horses i was talking about that was upstairs i forgot that i had two other horses that i got for christmas so i'm going to talk about them now so the first one here is abdul and i got this guy when briar had like that black friday sale or whatever when they brought back some of the older horses um for the original prices that they had them for. So I got this guy. Um, I was in the collector club last year. Two years ago now. What the heck. Um, so I really wanted him. So I picked him up. Um, also like what I'm saying. Like I picked this horse and I got this horse. Like I picked out all these horses. And then like my mom saved them and got them for Christmas. That's why I'm saying that. Um, just to clarify. And then the other one here is St. Moritz and he was the one of the horses that you know you enter when you're in the collector's club and I literally never win those entries um I tried for almost every single one last year and <laughs> lo and behold I won St. Moritz so yay um I'm really happy that I won 
this guy because he's just gorgeous. And if you don't know, like, I'm a really big fan of the seasonal decorators. Like, they're, like, my favorite things to collect. That's why I love the Halloween horses so much. Um, and so when I saw that they were making, like, a winter decorator, I just, oh, I pretty much died. I love him. He's gorgeous. He's so pretty. And I'm so happy to have him. And I have to pay more than the retail price for him. I'm so happy. Um, and then this set that I got, the other set, was the, um, the new unicorns. And I love them. And they were the Collector Club exclusive. Another Collector Club exclusive. Like, a lot of these were Collector Club exclusives, to be honest. Um, and yeah, I'm really happy that Briar is making more unicorns it seems because I really really love their unicorns and I feel like they keep getting better with each release to be honest I love these two so yeah those are the horses I got for Christmas um and that is all thanks for watching bye